Hi, it's me, Dennis Woodruff, and welcome to the Dennis Woodruff Experience. <laughs> I'm tired of reality shows. Um, I don't even watch TV. I haven't had a TV in my house in four years because I can't stand society filtering itself into my home. It's the only safe place I have, so I keep it out. So it's really not a too great of a question for me to answer. But but but, but I guess society but that, is reality. I guess society is reality TV. So no, I don't like it. <laughs> but there again, it's a contradiction because I'm at your house filming you to put you on TV, which is okay. Well, it's not a contradiction at all because I'm not going to be watching it. So what difference does it make? Do you like midgets? Um, do I like midgets? Yes, I think they're great. Well, we're trying to find a a good place for them in our society in our world. Do you think that midgets should be primarily in the entertainment business or used as, sl as slaves or have to work at McDonald's or do you think they should just be accepted as a normal member of society and they can do whatever they want? I think they already are accepted as a normal member of society. They and should do whatever they want. And, and I think they midgets, do say whatever midgets, they want. Midgets. We're talking about midgets. You have to repeat the question. Um, I did in the beginning. Uh, is it wrong to steal from the rich and give to the poor? Is it wrong to steal from the rich and give to the poor? No, I think the rich should give to the poor. Why I mean, is that? No one would have to be stealing at all. Because I think that people ought to learn how to give and understand the importance of it and what it does for their life and what it does for the people's life that they're giving to. What do you think of reality shows today? Are they good or bad or what? I hate them. Why? Because I don't like reality shows. I miss the old school TV shows. What's that uh, medal you're wearing? This is a butterfly. Oh, what does that mean to you? To me, nothing. I just like butterflies. Did someone special give that to you? No, I bought it myself. Okay. Do you think that we should steal from the rich and give to the poor? No. Why? Because the poor need to work for their money. Well, they need jobs. Yes, they do. Well, how, why don't we give them jobs? Okay, well, you can give them a job, but you can't steal from the rich to give to the poor. Are you a hippie? Yeah, a rocker. A rocker? Yeah. Who's your favorite musician? Uh, Steve Vai. Who's he? He's a guitarist extraordinaire. For who? He plays by himself. He's a, he's a well-known uh, in the guitar virtuoso. And uh, are you a musician? Yes, sir. What do you play? I play guitar, singer-songwriter. Really? Yes. Uh, can you tell us one of your songs? Uh, um, Love's name? Rainbow. Uh, Who did that one? <laughs> um, I, I recorded it myself. I have three okay. albums myself. Cool. Believe it, man. We got a real celebrity mm -hmm. right here. Rock and roll. Sex, drugs, and rock and roll. Rock and roll. I hate to put you on the spot, but could you do a few lines from Love's Rainbow? Sure. Um, Want to paint you a picture, lady? Let the colors fill your eyes. Um, loves a beautiful rainbow. Sorry. Choking okay. here. Go ahead. Sorry, hold on one second. Okay. Action! Sorry, Dennis. That's <laughs> all right, man. I'm just totally spacing out. Yeah, I'd love to give you some of the lyrics, but I've got to get to the studio today. I'm a little, little busy. If you'd like to get a hold of me, get a hold of me at scovert.com. Uh, scovert67, S-C-O-V-E-R-T-67 at yahoo.com. And um, I'd love to be on the show and show you what my music's really all about. Um, I'm a professional. I've been doing this over 20 years. And I've had nothing but rave reviews. Do you know Dennis Woodruff? Uh, no. I'm a famous actor. Uh -huh. Okay, uh, it's nice to meet you. I like your stuff. 
this chick, man, uh, on this billboard for Calvin Klein. Do you think she's really hot? No, no, no. She's not that good looking. Hot, man. I think she's totally a babe. It's okay. Good to see you. Yeah, good to see you, man. Yeah. See you, Dennis. I'm Dennis Woodruff. Hi. Hi, Dennis. I have all your tapes. I, I can't afford any more right now. Oh, but I got a new movie that just came out. It's called L.A. Do you want to get it? it? How much? Ten bucks. Ten bucks? That's outrageous! Yeah, but it's worth it, man. Yeah, they are pretty entertaining, actually. Actually, oh. I'm sold out today, so maybe next time? Yeah, I'm sure I'll see you tomorrow somewhere. Okay. As usual. Okay, bye. See you then. I love you, man. Love you more. Peace and love. Can I help you? Uh, yes, sir. My name is Dennis Woodruff, and uh, I used to come by and give my movies. Do you remember me? Is Mr. Hafner in today? Hello? Uh, sir, I'm not at liberty to say if Mr. Hafner is here or not here. Oh, well, uh, I was just wondering, how would I get him on my TV show? You have to contact Playboy's marketing division or Playboy's uh, public relations department. Okay, well, thank you very much, and have a nice day. I'll do that. You too, sir. Take care. How you doing? Big time security for Mr. Hefner. I'm out here outside of the Hugh Hefner Playboy Mansion, and as you can see, it's not easy to get an interview with Mr. Hefner. However, I'm not going to give up, and uh, I'm going to try to go through normal channels. I, I like to see Hef and uh, meet him. I, I, I think he's a pretty cool guy. He's an old timer, but uh, he's got a lot of things to say. He sure has a lot of chicks, man. Why does he need all those chicks? I'm doing a TV show. It's called The Dennis Woodruff Experience. And I was wondering if I could ask you a few positive questions. I'm out here in the Palisades, and people aren't very percept uh, receptive to me. <laughs> but you're really wow. nice. OK. Uh, would you go for that? Uh, well, it depends. I don't have much time, but okay, if, well, whatever. If you yeah. can give me the uh, abridged version, that would be great. Okay. Uh, are you tired of TV uh, reality shows on TV, or do you really like them? i sick of them. Uh, do you think it would help maybe if they had real actors and actresses? Because to me, the talent they choose <laughs> are really boring. You, uh, you, are you opinion. talking about the real people? Yeah. Well, you know what? Some of the um, I have to say, you know, it's a toss-up about who's more boring—the real people or the actors in television today. So, you, you know, there's a real fine line between that nowadays. They're all pretty much a dime a dozen, as far as I'm concerned. What do you do for a living, sir? I'm an actor. <laughs> no, oh, yeah. no, I'm kidding. No, I'm not. No. You're probably a brain surgeon. No, I'm not a brain surgeon. No. Have you ever heard of Dennis Woodruff? Yes, I have. Very well, that's famous. Me. Very and famous. Very famous throughout Los Angeles. He's almost an institution. Or he should have been institutionalized, or he terrorizes L.A.? Yeah, he terrorizes L.A. You can always tell <laughs> who he is because he's driving around in that crazy car with his picture plastered all over it, and all of his, his complete resume goes from the hood to the drunk. <laughs> you think maybe somebody should take this guy seriously? Maybe he's a genius. You know what? I... Uh, you know what? Maybe. Maybe so. Maybe so. Oh, what a neat t-shirt. Um, yeah, it's pretty sweet. <laughs> you said, what did you say? You have one of my t-shirts? I do have one of your t-shirts. A Dennis He's Woodruff t-shirt? I don't know if I'm a big shirt. fan. I'm a big fan of the shirts. Yeah, yeah. You don't like no. my t-shirt? Um, yeah, you're a lovely lady. Um, <laughs> isn't she a lovely lady? Oh, yeah. yeah. In your opinion, sir, do you think that reality shows are terrible or really good? And if so, or if not, why? In my opinion, sir, do I think that... I'm just kidding. Do I think reality TV shows are terrible? Yes, I think they suck. And why? Because they're not entertaining. I, my family's way more entertaining and crazy than half the people on those shows. I'd rather watch a show with a script and uh, a story and actors and... He, I'd rather watch a TV show than people getting followed around by a camera. Actually, you know, I was thinking about it last night, is that I'm an actor, and my life is like a TV show, so maybe they're missing the boat.